Nurse Sophie is catching up on some charting when a new patient is admitted. Hi Bill, my name is Sophie and I will be your registered nurse today. Can you tell me what brought you here today? Hi Nurse Sophie, I've been going through a really rough time lately with my mental health. I could really use your help. Nurse Sophie reads Bill's chart and notices that he lives in an Aboriginal community. Sophie isn't very familiar with Indigenous culture and doesn't have very much experience with mental health nursing. Sophie decides to talk to her nurse educator for some guidance. Sophie, I'm glad you came to me. There are two different theories I think you should review that may help you decide on how to help Bill. The first is a contemporary theory called the Title Model by Phil Barker and Poppy Buchanan Barker. The second is a more classic theory called the Culture Care Theory by Madeline Leniger. Nurse Sophie decides to take her educator's advice and do some research. First, Sophie looks at the title model. The goal of the title model is to empower its service users in the recovery process. The model seeks to understand the service users' problems in living by allowing them to tell their own narrative, which often changes, rather than just trying to treat the service user as a person with a problem that they randomly developed in their life. The title model really wants to understand why these events have taken place. There are four main concepts in the title model. The security plan gives service users an opportunity to create a plan to keep them safe and in control of their situation. The holistic assessment allows the user to share their ever-changing narrative in their own words. The one-to-one -one session encourages users to apply what they have learned during the holistic sessions and search for solutions to potentially reoccurring problems in living. Group sessions allow the service user to open up about their problems in living and share their personal solutions with others in the group who may benefit from this. Hmm, it seems like this model could work well for Bill since he's in a mental health crisis. Next, Nurse Sophie reviews Linager's culture care theory. There are three modalities imperative to providing culturally congruent care. First, culture care, preservation, and maintenance which helps retain and preserve care beliefs and values. Second is culture care accommodation and or negotiation, which helps cultures adapt to others for culturally safe and effective care of health, or to deal with illness or death. Third is culture care repatterning and or restructuring, which changes or modifies values and in institutions for better practice and outcomes. Sophie also notices that Linager developed something called enablers, and there is one that catches her eye called the Sunrise Enabler. This model grants nurses the ability to provide culturally appropriate and purposeful care to people in all stages of health, illness, and death. Hmm, this model is also very important. I think it is crucial to consider Bill's culture and his recovery as well and this Sunrise Enabler is the perfect tool to allow me to do that. Hi Sophie, which theory did you pick to help Bill? I'm going to use a combination of both the title model and the culture care theory so that I can learn more about Bill's personal story and help keep him safe, but also consider his culture and incorporate that into his care. I think he'll benefit the most from this. Wow, I think that's a great idea Sophie. Hi Bill, why don't we sit down and talk? I want to learn about what makes you you. Can you tell me about where you came from and how you grew up? The things that are important to you in life? I want to know about you and your culture so I can give you the best care possible. Then we can develop a safety plan together to protect you from harm and talk some more about what brought you in today. today. Wow, thanks Nurse Sophie. I really appreciate you taking the time to get to know me and my culture.